Back with the WMAY morning news feed. And of course, the season of giving is upon us. And it's time for you to be thinking about the various places you want to give. And I know one place I've given to in the past, and I'm definitely going to be giving again this year, is Coomler Outreach Ministries because of the incredible work they do. And joining us right now is Sharon Brown. She is the uh, executive director, is that right, with Coomler? Uh, so thanks for taking time with us here in studio. How are you? Greg. Absolutely. So uh, for those who aren't familiar with Coomler, tell us a bit about uh, the stuff you guys do. Sure. Um, we have a food pantry. We have a prescription assistance program. And right now we're in the middle of um, creating some basic life skills programs that we hope will help people down the road. So with this, uh, you have, of course, the um, uh, the food program, a pantry, kind of a traditional pantry of sorts. Uh, talk about how the consumer uh, of of your uh, products, uh, sure. let's say, uh, how they interact with you. Sure. When someone has a need for food, they um, we are open five days a week in the morning, so they can just come in and they check in with us, and then they go through almost like being in a grocery store and shopping. They go from shelf to shelf and pick out the items they want based on the size of their family, and then they just take it home with them. Pretty simple process. What does that do, though, for somebody uh, who is of less means, finding mm -hmm. themselves in a hard position uh, instead of just getting like a, a, a box that's sent to them of, of goods? What does it do to kind of have that feel of being able to kind of shop on their own, so to speak? Right. Um, I think it gives people a lot of choice. It, it empowers them. I think there's a sense of dignity. We've heard from people that, you know, this is nice that I get to pick what I want to choose. Um, particularly during the pandemic when a lot of places had to go to just box foods, people would say to us, we're, you know, we're so appreciative of what we get everywhere, but it's nice to go through and pick what we want to take home with us. We're talking with Sharon Brown. She is with Coomler Outreach Ministries. Uh, if people hearing this have never donated before, how can they uh, make a donation and what kind of donations are you guys looking for? Sure. You know, we will always take any type of food items, non-perishable um, specifically, um, right now, we're really, it, it's interesting, one of the things that has happened is during the pandemic, there was a canned shortage. So it's harder for us to get things like canned soups, canned fruit. So if people see those and they want to give those to us, that would be great. They can always make a financial donation. They can, you know, mail it to us if they like to use mail, 303 North Grand Avenue East, Springfield, 62702. Or right now with Feed the Need, they can go to our website, kumlerministries.net, and um, give it to us via PayPal. Feed the Need going on right now uh, through when? Through Christmas Day, I believe, is wow. we're running it. Great. So uh, definitely you want to help feed the need and uh, get the resources that Kumler Outreach Ministries needs. And it's not just, um, you know, the, the non-perishable food items and the cash donations that will help with prescription costs mm -hmm. for those who need it. Do you guys also look for some of the fresher items like we meats? We do. We do. We've had people donate meat. We've had people donate fresh produce. You know, during the gardening season, we have a lot of people that give us produce, and that's a really great thing for people because, face it, that's expensive stuff when you go to the grocery store. No, no question about it. Uh, and, of course, they've got uh, the, the sponsor of uh, Magro Meats helping us with Feed the Need. So a uh, great collection of, uh, of dedicated people here in central Illinois helping out Coomler Outreach Ministries to get the uh, services that uh, those who find themselves uh, in, a, in, a, in a tough spot this holiday season, uh, the work you guys do goes a long way. So, again, give us the information uh, about uh, where people can donate, uh, either in person, by check, or online. Sure. They can donate online at kumlerministries.net. They can mail to 303 North Grand Avenue East, Springfield, 62702. They can drop by at our building, any food donations, or also right now they can drop by at Magros and donate. Fantastic. So, again, keep that in mind. Your donations will go a long way for Feed the Need here with WMAY, Magro Meats, and also Coomler Outreach Ministries. Sharon, thank you so much for taking time with us this morning. Best of luck, and uh, thank you so much for all the work you guys do. Thank you, Greg. It is the WMAY morning news feed on 92.7 WMAY.